Hey, what's up, YouTubers? IT vs. Everybody here again with a brand new episode coming at you. So today I'm going to show you how to do the best color rush hacks that I know. So what you're trying to do is you're trying to get these heroes as fast as possible, and I want to help you do that. So right now, if you look at my team, you can see I got the color rush Russell Wilson. I've got the color rush Ebron. Oh, I also have the color rush Devontae Adams, which happens after you have two sets. And then you can get unlock another one after four sets. Not bad. And then I got Kareem Jackson and Joey Bosa. And right now I am going after Xavier Rhodes. So we'll see how that goes. So first thing you want to do is if you go into the color rush events, you'll see all these. They'll say new and you'll see I haven't played them right by the repeatable. Uh, you see, I haven't played these events yet. When you do play these events, um, you want to play each and every one of these so that you'll have the first win event. So it's almost essentially doubling up um, the rewards for doing these while the event's new. And then after you've done that, the best method is to go through and do these on the side again. Because when you do it on the side, you have a chance at elite player. Don't do the finale, but getting the equipment. The equipment will actually get you a chance at an elite player where if you just do these color blitzes, you're only going to get that uh, gold player. So now, if I go to my team and I go to my locker room, you can see that I'm using the color rush time booster and the color rush token booster. Now, this can be bought in the store. And what I like to do is buy that color rush time booster all the way so that I'm only waiting. It should be 60 minutes, but there's some type of glitch within EA where you got to wait like an hour and 45 minutes. But it's much better than the original four hours. And it's going to allow you to uh, progress through the game and get more color rush users. And what I will say is you're, um, you're adding one color rush badge each time. So... If I go in here, go over to Color Rush, then you'll see here, so you got this first thing, right? This is just the patches. You can't do anything here. Um, that's all done when you're doing the events. Then you got a Color Rush player. That's where you would do the equipment. And if you see on here, information to earn a gold or better Color Rush player. And that's the, the part that you got to take notice of. Is I haven't actually pulled out an Elite doing it, but there's the potential that that could happen so now you scroll over and you got the player that's how you're getting the uh, elite player by trading in the 20 uh, gold players and 20 um, badges and this color infusion that's the one where it knocks the time off for you so look at this keep scrolling so I take this MLB right and then I take this color rush green patch. So I'm losing one of these here when I do this. So I just lost one, but I'm gaining another one. So it's really just one every time. You're just one upping every hour or so. And then what I'm gonna do is I'll look and see. He looks like he's blue. I'll cut him to uh, badges. And now as you see, I got two more blue badges. And then another thing, it depends on how many players you're going for, but you just might want to see how many badges you have of a certain color and kind of do it from there. Otherwise, you'll just be grinding it out um, forever. So if you have 20 blue and 4 purple and you're going for Xavier Rhodes, you might, you might be better off if you just go for um, a blue player at that point and then go for the Xavier Rhodes later, save those 4 and allow them to accumulate. Or if you're the kind of person that likes to just save up, then just, just save up that way. So one other thing I wanna show you is how I've been making money. Now, I'm not gonna lie to you. You're gonna need a lot of money to make this money. So what you wanna do is you wanna go to Marketplace and then you wanna go to Auction and you wanna hit Search. Go ahead and reset your search if you had something else in there. And then under programs, pick Color Rush. Type in Adams. 
and then look through the prices here. So, I mean, you can put in a price if you want, but I'm just showing you that they're out here. So you see this Devontae Adams over here. Where is he? Right here for a million. Go ahead and buy him. And now I have a Devontae Adams for a million. And if you look on here, the next closest to that million is probably that one million. Oh, there you go. One million two hundred seventy thousand. So think about this, if I sell that player for 1,250,000 coins, they're going to take their 10%. When they take their 10%, it's only going to be about 110,000. That's going to leave me with 140,000 coins just for one transaction. Now yes, you need a million coins to make it, but once you have that million, this has been a great method. And if you want to hold on to him, he might be worth a little more in a couple weeks. I got one right now on my team that I'm holding on to just to see what he goes for. But in the meantime, I'm trading on any other ones I acquire to make some money just in case something happens with the market. You know, this market's like the stock market. It could crash at any time. You never know. So depends on what they come out with. Maybe there's a better event when they come out with the Fear Factor events. Uh, it's most feared. Um, it's really a wait and see. Now, another thing I want to invite you guys to check out is... So check out my Madden Discord server in the link below. This will get you news and things. So, you, I mean, everybody uses Mutt. Mutt's great. But if you want active users, if you, want, if you don't want to post a message and then wait for somebody to respond to it, um, you know, 30, 40 minutes... If we get a big enough community on the Discord server, we can have it where it's fluent. You know, it's almost like you're in a chat room at that point. And I try to put it in uh, categories where it makes the most sense. Like, uh, what's your platform that you're on? Do you want to discuss Madden Mobile? Do you want to just have a general discussion? Um, what are the strategies that you're using? Is there questions that anybody has for some of the admins that we can throw out there? Is there a league that you're recruiting for and you want to put it in there? Whether it's on the PlayStation 4 if, or if you're using Madden Mobile. Um, or what's coming up? What's uh, some changes that you think EA should implement? Maybe we should reach out to them. So all those things. Um, the, the possibilities are really endless. It's really the first Discord server in its kind um, to support the Madden platform. And uh, I mean, we hope to grow this platform. If uh, you have any questions or if you want to join, just just join. Um, we do have some rules, but that's with any server or chat room or forum that you go to it are going to have some rules. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, please subscribe, and I'll keep making these videos. Uh, try to help you out. You just help me out by hitting subscribe, hit that bell. You'll see when I come out with some new videos. And I appreciate everybody watching. I really do. Thank you, and have a blessed day.